Hi everyone, today I decided to test whether it was possible to complete the sweet treat challenge in The Sims Mobile without using anything but sugar cubes. So the challenge was I wasn't allowed to spend any simoleons, sim cash or cupcakes to complete these rounds. I'm doing five rounds because I thought if you can't complete five rounds using just sugar cubes, you definitely can't complete nine. So let's see if it actually is possible. So this is round one. I'm going to use two sugar cubes to get 6% more because I'm at 85 at the moment. I want to get through round one. 91% should be enough, so let's bake it. My aim is to get to at least 90%, hopefully, each round to give me the best chance of getting through. So round two, here we come. We're starting with a 75% chance. What options do we have? There's only two options available. One of them costs simoleons, so we can't do that. We only have the 6% option that costs two sugar cubes each time. So it looks like we're going to get for our sugar cubes fairly quickly with this being the only option. I'm going to have to do it a few more times because I need to get at least 90%. That's my aim anyway. Do we risk it or do I do it again? Let's do it again, I think. That gives us 93%. Let's give it a go and bake it. Fingers crossed. Great. So we got through round two. Now on to round three. The aim of this is to see if it's actually possible without spending all your simoleons and sim cash. Because obviously the aim really is for you to spend everything on these events. So we've got two options again, one of them costs simoleons, so we have to do the two sugar cubes one for 6%. And we started with 65% this time, so it's going to take a few goes and quite a few sugar cubes. Oh, we're at 89%. Shall we do it one more time? I think we better. We're at 95% now. We should be able to complete this. Great. Round three is done. Two more rounds to go. And we only have 12 sugar cubes left. Can't see this going very well. Round four. There's quite a few options this time, but one of them costs in cash. Another one costs simoleons, one of them costs two sugar cubes, and the other one costs four. So we're going to go with the four one because we get 14%. I really wish there were more sugar cube options in the previous rounds, instead of just the two sugar cubes one for 6%. As we only have six sugar cubes left, I really want to save those for the final round, if we make it through. So we're at 80% right now, and I think that is going to be the best we're going to get. So let's bake it. Big fingers crossed this time. I hope it works. Yes. Brilliant. One more round to go then. So with a bit of luck, we've made it through to round four. Round five may be slightly more tricky. So we start with 50% and we only have six sugar cubes left. Again, there are two sugar cube options. We definitely are going to go with the four sugar cubes one. The other two options are cupcakes and simoleons. So we don't want to pick those. So this is a 14% one. That leaves us with only two sugar cubes though. So we have to go for the other sugar cube option. And I can't see us completing this one. We only have 64% now. Those two sugar cubes have added on and made it to 70%. So we're going to have to bake it, see what happens. 70% chance. I don't think it's going to happen. Let's see. No, 
Look at that. That is burnt. Oh, no. Dessert disaster. What a shame. Although, honestly, that's what I expected. I didn't think it would be possible to complete this using only sugar cubes because that's how it's designed. They want you to spend all your sim cash and your simoleons to be able to complete it. I would say the best way to do this with only sugar cubes is to complete as many rounds as you possibly can. So if you can only complete four rounds and you use all your sugar cubes on that, then you can collect and quit there and then you'll still get all your tokens and that. You just won't get the final round or you know, how many other rounds there are after that. But you will still get something from it. And that would probably be the best way to do it if you do not want to spend all your simoleons and sim cash. If you found this video helpful, please like it and please subscribe to my channel. I regularly post Sims Mobile videos. I also have a blog, thegogames.blog, and on there you can find loads of posts about the Sims Mobile and the Sims Freeplay. Thanks for watching. Bye!